What's up you guys? All right, our last field trip to this Blockbuster. Sadly, it closed yesterday, but they were selling all of the furniture and I mean everything that was a Check nail this guy out. What? He's got a dance going on. He does. He's enthusiastic. He was flat ass break dancing. <laughs> They were selling everything in basically that wasn't nailed down in the store. So I bought a couple of the large uh, movie racks and uh, we're going to replace the, the unit we have in there now. You know, the one that bows really bad. Uh, we're going to replace it uh, with the. Damn, did they already take down the Blockbuster signage? It'd be gone. <laughs> Look at that. Today's like the first full day that the store is gone and they've already taken down all the lettering. That's something entire store on sale. Yeah. All right, so we're going to head in and pick up our stuff. so it's all loaded these are all the racks I even got the gal she was nice enough to throw in the blockbuster mouse pad it's all loaded back here all right now the process begins and there it is the empty media case finally got all of them out and it, now it really looks like a hoarder's paradise. Look, this is, it, it's embarrassing, really. Look at this. There's just crap everywhere. I'm going to go through, before we, before I start putting stuff back in, I'm going to really kind of sort through the collection. Probably start, um, you know, thinning it out a little bit. But there we go. There's a look at at the at the case empty. So hopefully tomorrow morning we will get the the new racks up and I will start filling it in. Here it is all complete. And it looks pretty good. Very happy with it. We turned the the blue in the background, originally at the store it was turned to face the window so you could see it from the outside, so we just turned it around. And uh, it came together pretty easy. It's missing one little crossbar in the back right there, but no big deal. They didn't have any extras. So now I'm going to, like I mentioned before, thin out the collection a little bit, and then uh, catalog everything, and then start to put it back. The fun begins. And here we have it. Everything is, well just about everything, is in the new rack. Uh, you're going to have to excuse um, the mess. I still have a mess here. But uh, it, it's looking a lot better. I was able to fit uh, box sets up there. And then we've got, um, you know, more grown-up titles up there. Blu-rays and then DVDs. We've got, I think, documentaries and stuff in there. TV, and then the kid Blu-rays, kid DVDs. And on the bottom shelf, the bottom shelf is pretty much empty. Um, so I just put uh, a couple box sets, stuff like that. That's what's down there. But very pleased with it. And we only paid, um, how much were these each? 17 bucks? Because there's two racks and there were 17 each. So, like, you know, after tax, about almost 40 bucks for this huge rack. Very, very happy with it, seriously. Because now over here, well, excuse the mess, you know how we had all those VHS racks? Now these are, this is what I'm calling, you know, quote unquote, the stack. This is stuff we still need to watch. So I've put that there. And then. Over here, see this is still a disaster, but just ignore it. Um, over here by my desk, these are um, 
like horror movies. So basically these are ones only I'll watch. So those are over there. And then the VHS uh, I thinned out and just stuck over there under the Big Lebowski poster. But very, very happy. Um, you know, with the uh, with the rack, I think it turned out really nice. We were able to put a ton of stuff on there. I was able to thin out the collection nicely, and uh, and then I cataloged everything. I put it on. I believe it's called DVD Profiler. Um, Dean of DVD had mentioned it, and I had purchased the app, and so everything has been inputted. And oh, and then the little la the laser discs are over there. And there we go. That's everything. I'm very pleased. Oh, and real quick, uh, for Zombie Friday this week, it'll actually be probably Zombie Thursday morning. Because we're going to be leaving for WonderCon. We're going to be going down to Anaheim uh, Thursday afternoon. So I will post it probably early Thursday. I'll catch you guys later. Take care.